Okay. Intercom. All right, smooth skin. I'm letting you in. You better watch yourself. I'll sure as hell be watching you. Sorry, Just looking at something. God, but are you ugly? Get upstairs and talk to Speak Jason for yourself, Mustachio Furioso. You. Hey, you're not a ghoul. Your pranks won't work on me, Smooth Skin. They won't work on Jason either. God damn it, Chris. I guess I'll be going. Stay away from me. Pretty much, we come up here. We talk to Jason Voorhees. He's not Jason Voorhees. Yes. No. We talk to a good dude named Jason. This is Jason. Hello, Wanderer. Please forgive us our humble surroundings. Our true home talk to him. Us in the Go downstairs. Here. Have you come to help us deal with the demons? The great journey? Come back up here. Tell him we're all good, and then yeah. What's the deal with the human who let me in? You're referring to Chris. I doubt you had much luck if you tried telling him that he's human. We had the same discussions when he first appeared, and the same lack of success. He believes he is one of us. Soon enough, we realized that Chris was a poor, gift from poor, misguided, smooth skin. He is integral to the success of the Great Journey. What is the Great Journey? We wish to escape the barbarity of the wasteland, especially the violence and bigotry of its human inhabitants. The Creator has promised to my flock a new land, a place of safety and healing, a paradise in the far beyond. In space. Preparations space. for the Great Journey were nearly complete when the demons appeared. Tell me more about these demons. The demons appeared from nowhere, except it might be more accurate to say they never actually appeared at all. The demons are invisible. Where one of them stands, the most one sees is the air shimmering like sunlight on water. They set upon us as we were on our way to worship one morning. We had just entered the basement. My flock fought bravely and killed a few, but at such cost. Nearly half of us died or went missing. The rest of us retreated up here. One of the demons raved at us. But they have not tried to attack us since. Still, their demonic presence brought all progress towards the great journey to a standstill. But now you have come. Once again, the Creator has sent a human to help us across a seemingly insurmountable obstacle. Uh, you say one of the demons raved at you. Yes, over the intercom. Threats of death should we step outside. Guarantees of safety should we stay locked away. It went on for hours and did not always make sense. But that was the first day only. Since then, silence. Will you drive away the demons, Wanderer? I'll take care of the demons for you. Praise the Creator. Bless you, Wanderer. Bless us all. As soon as the underground has been rid of demons, Preparations for the great journey can resume. Okay. Um. Now, I don't know if this gun. That gun. I don't know if this will, uh. This will count towards the challenge. Kill super mutants with. Yeah. I don't know if, if it'll count towards the challenge. Now, I'm gonna save before we go down there. I'm gonna tell my dudes to hold back. And I'm gonna go kill, I forget what the dude's name is, but his, uh, his schizophrenia, I'm pretty sure I said that wrong. But the dude he fucking talks to in his head is named Stantler. Pretty sure his name is Davidson. We'll t we'll talk to him first, you know. Uh, 
Safety save, you know. Safety save. We're here, guys. I'll sit. Yeah. Dark. What's that, Antler? We have a visitor. Yeah, Davidson. An assassin, more like. I say kill it, Antler. For safe sake. Hmm? Okay, Antler, I'll ask. Ah, uh, hi, human. Why you come here? I'm here on behalf of the ghouls upstairs. Ah. Uh, right the first time, ugly. I've come to kill you. Never! Antler protects! You feel Antler's horns now! Oh, fuck me! dead that's why we do the safety save okay uh you guys aren't fucking waiting you guys are coming with me I'm like, fuck you Did count, fuck yeah. We're going to do another safety save. Guys. Safety save, obviously. Scared the ever-loving fucking shit out of me. God 
him. Thank God for the drugs. I went down the wrong way. for bats or else I would have never got any of these. Okay, so we shot his fucking flamer out of his hand. Incinerator. There's lots of looting to do down here. We'll save that for another time. But we're coming down here. Because there's a body down here that we have to fucking look at. And all our drugs went off. Here it is. Yeah, because there's a lot of fucking junk here that we're going to need. Well, we don't need it, per se. But more like we can use it. So, I think we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good with all this shit. I went the wrong way. But there's a door here. We'll open. And it's full of junk. Of batteries that we can actually pick up this time. So essentially, if you wanted to keep these guys alive, the thing you would have to do is uh, talk to him. He'll tell you to retrieve, uh, retrieve stealth boys from. There's a, a room right beside where he was, but you'll see. You'll see in a minute. And then you had to come all the way down here to find that dead ghoul. Yeah. Yeah. But the thing is, I I don't remember 100%, but I'm pretty sure you ha you had to sneak down here. Because the other Nightkin aren't as nice as da as Davidson was. Yo! Come and get it, you big dumb. Hey, you're not one of those things out there. No, I'm not. Who the hell are you? I'm exploring, that's all. What about you? Maybe you noticed a bunch of invisible monsters out there. I've been in here, trying not to get dead. 
Uh, what can you tell me about these creatures out there? I kill them on sight, so we haven't had much time to get acquainted. Yeah. They're hard to see, obviously, but they are too smart when it comes to tactics. We're not stepping in traps. How'd you end up trapped down here? First off, I'm not trapped. This was a tactical choice, all right? I'm no match for those things out there. So I found a good defensive position, and I've been defending it, right? Oh, who am I fooling? I'm trapped. Name's Harlan. Pleased to meet you. What happened was, I was escorting folks down to work when those things attacked us. Most of the fight was upstairs, but some folks panicked and made for the basement, and I went after them. Well, turns out there were even more of those bastards down here than upstairs, and things went to shit fast. I couldn't find the others, so I fell back to this room, set up a nice little kill zone, and a story. Uh, you don't look like the other ghouls from Bright's group. Guess the outfit gives that away, huh? I never did buy into that religious mumbo jumbo with the robes and all that shit. It gets lonely out in the wastes, okay? And I don't have to tell you that Bright's group has got some fine looking ghoulettes in it. Uh, or maybe I would have to tell you. Anyway, I helped them out, and they kept me supplied with ammo and pleasant company. Uh, how can I help you get out of this room? Huh. Well, you're polite. I'll give you that. If this was just between you and me, I'd do as you ask. But it's not. I had a friend with me when those mutant bastards came out of nowhere. She panicked and ran the wrong direction. Further into the basement, she's probably dead. But I ain't leaving until I know for sure. I'd have gone looking myself, except I wouldn't last a minute out there. You, on the other hand, seem pretty resourceful. Find my friend, and I'll get out of your way. I did find her, unfortunately. I see. Spare me the details. Goddamn. She had the yellowest smile. You did your part, so I'll do mine. Go ahead and root around up here if you want. I'm going to make a break for... Yeah, essentially he lived by pissing in the co in a corner and eating rad roaches. Access it and then go back to Davidson with what you know. Okay, let's head back upstairs. Pretty much now the quest is just go upstairs, come back downstairs, go back upstairs again. It's fairly easy if you grab the shit you need before you fucking leave. Or before you come here, I should say. Is the way clear? Yes, the demons are gone. Praise the Creator, and bless you, Wanderer. The way is clear. I will lead my flock through the basement, 
to the sacred site. I the hope you will come find the us there. Father of Adam. There is much to be done. And they all leave. Every single one of them runs to the basement. Runs to the basement. Except Eddie. Yeah, we'll just take a second. Let them go. And then we loot. I loot, you loot, we all loot the shit that is up here. There's a reason why we have bad karma. It's because we're a thief. A dirty little thief. Well, in reality, they didn't take it, so... It's theoretically fair game. It has retirement. Sorry, force of habit of bending down to pick things up. Party hats! There's more stuff up here. Guess I was wrong. Uh, we'll loot. We'll loot all the stuff. Uh, uh, hello, dude. I want to do a safety save and try and kill this guy. Space suit. I get away with this. I hope I get away with this because it's gonna be fucking hilarious getting all my companions to wear fucking spacesuits.
Fine by me. Cause this isn't supposed to happen. Those guys are supposed to already be down there. I just hope that they're not mad at me whenever I walk over here. I did technically kill all their friends. They don't look mad. Sup? <laughs> I waited to speak with you one last time before I descended to the launch pad, Wanderer. I want you to know that we will remember for all suits. eternity how you delivered us to the threshold of the great journey. Yeah, I delivered five of your compadres to the great beyond, my but friend. The rockets that will carry us to salvation are yet missing vital components. I already have the if components. If you would still help us, Wanderer, speak to Chris. Mm -hmm. He can tell you what is missing. There is no way that we can thank you enough, Wanderer. Yep. Your arrival here was a blessing. We will remember you always. Goodbye, Jason. There is no way that we can thank you enough, Wanderer. Your arrival... Yep. So... I'll just tell you this. The spacesuit right here, that's supposed to be the only one you can pick up in the game. It's only used... Yes. The, the, the... Yeah, see, the, there's like none of them down there. So, the spacesuit is used on two class two types of characters the characters for this area right here see there's one right there and then the assets for it are reused for old world blues for a small handful of enemies we'll see it whenever we get to old world blues but we're not supposed to have six fucking space suits but we do! So we're gonna outfit all of our followers with fucking spacesuits, and it's gonna be hilarious. Jason says that I am to cooperate with you on the final tasks necessary to launch the Great Journey. Yeah, Chris, we're gonna send three people to space. Using each of them to get their own rocket. How can I help? I was close to completing work on the rockets before we were driven into hiding on the top floor. Two components were missing. A quantity of isotope 239 igniting agent and a set of thrust control modules. The igniting agent is highly radioactive and uh -huh. decays quickly. That's why we can't use the drums that leak down on the launch pad. It's no longer potent enough. I need you to find an intact, shielded container of the igniting agent. As for the thrust control modules, they were custom built for these rockets. Yeah. They won't even launch without them. I'll track down the igniting Very agent. well. We don't need a huge amount. Two to three liters should be enough. I found an entire containing container of the igniting agent. Yes, that's the stuff. And the container shielding must be intact or you'd be dead by now. Now all I need is the thrust control modules. I found the thrust control modules. Indeed you did. And they seem to be in excellent condition. The rockets are set to re or set. Hamna <laughs> hamna. The rockets are set to go. Yes, I'll tell Jason that the great journey can right. begin. Now he goes on monologuing while we loot shit. Fine by me. In all honesty, we're probably going to be fucking wearing our space suit. We'll 
give him the new controller truck. You take good care of our truck. Oh, right, and we have and we have Dinky the T Rex souvenir. We have Noam Chomsky and Dinky the T Rex souvenir. Out of my way! Sorry for y'all. Kisses. Boom. Boom. Kisses. In all honesty, fucking, a lot of the bullshit that I'm fucking doing, I, I'm fucking literally just pair, fucking dripping it off a of fucking, uh, El Chess Breach. You guys should go fucking watch El Chess Breach. He is much more entertaining than fucking I am. Whenever I figure out how to mod this game, we're gonna have such a fucking good time. Oh, he's done. Okay. We'll go back, talk to Chris. We talk to Chris. Oh, we don't even have to talk to Chris. <laughs> I'm just wasting time. We'll still go talk to Chris because we we're gonna tell Chris to go to Novak. Because you see, you can you can still fucking talk to Chris. Because Chris gets pissed off, man. Pissed the f off. Did you hear him? My god, you were right all along. I'm no ghoul. They were just using me. Well, in all honesty, man, you were like fucking bitching me out whenever I tried telling you you weren't a fucking ghoul. And you were like, haha, funny joke, fuck off. But, yeah, you're pathetic. No wonder they're leaving you behind. Leave me up. Leave me alone. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I, I I did the dick thing, but, you know. What's up? We have a scientist outfit now. Three fucking... Wow. Wow, okay. It's fucking half decent for a fucking... For a piece of... For fucking light armor. Because usually it's fucking... Like, I'm pretty sure the light armor that I'm wearing now is one... Is one of, if not the best light armor. We'll pick... We'll come back and pick up all this shit later. But, like... God damn. Um. You know what? I was gonna fucking leave it off at the fucking rockets. But we're like already fucking. We're already past the time that I usually set. God, I love this game. God, I love this game. Okay, uh, <laughs> like and subscribe if you want to see more of this bullshit. Because that is, what, three more suits? Probably four more suits? A fucking...
I don't know where the other body is. But that's three more suits. Yeah, okay, we're done. Like and subscribe, guys. And uh, we'll pick this up with the launching of the rockets. Yeah.